proud to announce today that we have reached a deal to end the shutdown and reopen the federal government. As everyone knows, I have a very powerful alternative, but I didn't want to use it at this time. Hopefully, it will be unnecessary. I want to thank all of the incredible federal workers and their amazing families who have shown such extraordinary devotion in the face of this recent hardship. You are fantastic people. You are incredible patriots. Many of you have suffered far greater than anyone, but your families would know or understand. And not only did you not complain, but in many cases, you encouraged me to keep going because you care so much about our country and about its border security. Again, I thank you. All Americans, I thank you. You are very, very special people. I am so proud that you are citizens of our country. When I say, make America great again, it could never be done without you, great people. In a short while, I will sign a bill to open our government for three weeks until February 15th. I will make sure that all employees receive their back pay very quickly or as soon as possible. It'll happen fast. I am asking Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell to put this proposal on the floor immediately. After 36 days of spirited debate and dialogue, I have seen and heard from enough Democrats and Republicans that they are willing to put partisanship aside, I think, and put the security of the American people first. I do believe they're going to do that. They have said they are for complete border security, and they have finally and fully acknowledged that having barriers, fencing, or walls, or whatever you want to call it, will be an important part of the solution. A bipartisan conference committee of House and Senate lawmakers and leaders will immediately begin reviewing the requests of our homeland security experts and experts they are, and also law enforcement professionals who have worked with us so closely. We want to thank Border Patrol, ICE, and all law enforcement. It's been incredible. Based on operational guidance from the experts in the field, they will put together a Homeland Security package for me to shortly sign into law. Over the next 21 days, I expect that both Democrats and Republicans will operate in good faith. This is an opportunity for all parties to work together for the benefit of our whole beautiful, wonderful nation. If we make a fair deal, the American people will be proud of their government for proving that we can put country before party. We can show all Americans and people all around the world that both political parties are united when it comes to protecting our country and protecting our people. Many disagree. But I really feel that, working with Democrats and Republicans, we can make a truly great and secure deal happen for everyone. Walls should not be controversial. Our country has built 654 miles of barrier over the last 15 years, and every career Border Patrol agent I have spoken with has told me that walls work. They do work. No matter where you go, they work. Israel built a wall, 99.9% .9 successful. Won't be any different for us. They keep criminals out. They save good people from attempting 
a very dangerous journey from other countries, thousands of miles, because they think they have a glimmer of hope of coming through. With a wall, they don't have that hope. They keep drugs out, and they dramatically increase efficiency by allowing us to patrol far larger areas with far fewer people. It's just common sense. Walls work. 